a dream I know Deep up my feelings feel Hello reality viewers, welcome back again to Reality Latest Gist, the home of news and politics. For this channel, we they drop news every day and we they react to every video when it comes our way. And our reality news now we they drop for this channel and we they also they talk on as it be. If today not the first time we say they come across this channel, you are highly welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by. And if you are returning subscribers, I appreciate all of you now for our massive support to this channel i say may god bless all of you now in jesus name amen i get video away i want to present to una this very moment and i'm going to follow now they watch the video after we don't watch them together make we drop our opinion constructively for the comment section like our videos and also share our videos if possible bye for now Edo State Governor Gordon Obaseke on Monday, 18 September 2023, don't lock in Deputy Governor Right Honorable Comrade Philip Shaibu for outside, say make the Deputy Governor not enter in office for Government House. Them lock the gates to the office of the Deputy Governor and the main entrance will lead to the story building with big, big padlocks and chains. Shaibu and the aides come sit down and wait for outside for almost one hour before he can come out. Why in they wait? Oga Shaibu can't talk, say in try call the Governor tire, but he no answer. Now this one can't make Oga Shaibu can't do to talk with the State Commissioner of Police and the Director of State Security services DSS as to let them know how them take lock in office make it for no enter. I come office now and yeah and the gate is locked. They but not the gate. But the outer gate and the inner one they can lock and chain it. Yeah. I mean, the governor said they should lock it. That they are using the office for something else. I have not moved to anywhere. Nobody has given me a letter to move to anywhere. I am, nobody has given me letter. So, if governor say I've moved, I'm not moved. I, I'm not moved. The governor did not give me letter. Nobody has given me letter to move. So, how will I move out of my office? I'm here now, the gate is locked. I'm bad locked. So, maybe, I don't know. So, it's called, I call the governor, is not picking. So, you call the governor that I didn't move because I didn't get any letter to move. Only the civil servant got letter to move. I'm told that the civil servant were giving letter from the office of uh, uh, HOS to move out of this place. But me, I didn't get any letter to move. So I'm here. Let you come and open the gate, please. And I call the governor that I'm at the gate. Let you please come and open the gate. Shaibu can also call the government house camp commander to Ibrahim Baba to the SP and come ask him why they lock him outside the office. The commander at Conte Oga Shaibu say na order from above na in them they follow and say make him call the CSO of government house Williams Waba as na go fit explain better. Oga Shaibu can call Williams Waba who promised Shaibu say in the road they come but he not show face at all at all before Oga Shaibu can finally come out. We could not forget say as we see him now so we they talk him. We know they take blame. From government house Benin City, Ekata Ojesali, TMC TV News. We admire the way you run your livestock industry for Namibia and our area as a state we would like Chukai to see opportunities and how we will collaborate to help us steam the protein shortfall for the country in Nigeria. Edo State Governor Godwin Obase Kinyan this one where he hold one Ogbonge meeting with Namibia Ambassador to Nigeria, Humphrey Giseb and his wife Lina for government house Benin City to Chukai for the trade and investment opportunities for livestock production, technology and management services amongst others between the Namibia and Edo State. Oga Abaseki call for increased collabo to push economic growth and reap other economic benefits where go increase bilateral trade relations between the national and subnational government and say Belest with and well as sake of say they meet one on one on government level to true guide for the opportunities where they are valuable in terms of economy and other forms of collabo as Niger gets good relationship with Namibia in terms of the struggle for independence to date. It comes to talk, say, Namibia gets strong economy and still get challenges like other African countries, but them don't establish global competitiveness for other areas. And that's now why I don't go like collaborate with them and say him as governor, believe say opportunities they in terms of services. It comes to talk, say, you know, see why he no go work with some of the Namibia professional services firms for the areas of technology, management services and others, and say he they count on them for their support to see how they go join body with Edo for agricultural matter so that Edo go establish working relationship with the people of Namibia. I also appreciate the fact that we've taken the time out to meet with us 
on um, a government to government basis to also ex to explore the opportunities that are available in terms of um, economic and other co cooperation. Yes, you're right, we've had a great and cordial relationship with your country from the days of the struggle for independence uh, through, you know, till, till, till date. We also appreciate the fact that we're now extending the cooperation beyond the national, you know, the national relationships to subnational relationships. As you know, um, the businesses and citizens live in states, and so we're not surprised that many countries like yours and diplomats like you are now begin to, you know, go into the countries to see how we can undertake um, relation. I mean, business and uh, do business together taking advantage of the bilateral agreements and other agreements which have already been established between our two countries. Um, we know Namibia is, has a strong economy and it has challenges like many other African countries, but there are, very, there are some areas in which you have established global competitiveness and in, it's in those areas we would like to cooperate with you. Uh, we believe that opportunities exist in terms of the services. You know, we 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 don't see why we cannot uh, work with some of your firms, your professional services firms, and areas of technology, and areas of others. You know, management services. However, more importantly, we are we just admire the way you have run your livestock industry in your country and it's one area as a state we will be exploring opportunities to see how we can collaborate and cooperate and to help us stem the protein shortfall in our country um, we will be counting on your support to see how we you can twin us with uh, some the, the some high-value agricultural regions in Namibia um, and so we can establish working relationships with those regions and see how we can begin to boost investments and trade. Uh, we believe that this is just the first in many visits and uh, we will take time out when we are in Abuja to come and see you and to see how we can commence further conversations on these specific areas of cooperation. Once again, I want to thank you and your wife for taking time out to be our guests this afternoon and for this visit. So welcome once again to Edo State. Namibia Ambassador to Niger on Fiji, Sep Kontok said the visit not to chook eye for areas of investment for Edo State and say their collab between Niger and Namibia they very good as Niger don't support Namibia during their struggle for independence and say the two countries they maintain good relationship and will continue to ensure strong collab for different areas. He constitutes say this year or next year they will host the fifth session of the Niger Namibia Joint Commission of Cooperation to discuss cooperation for different areas. He constitutes say Edo State gets many opportunities where Namibia business people go tap into and say he hopes say them go come participate for the Benin Trade Expo. We go share soon and he go give them the opportunity to showcase Namibia products and also observe products where they produce for Edo State. The governor, Governor Obaseke of Edo State. Uh, we want to express our appreciation uh, for meeting with His Excellency the Governor this morning uh, to say a few words on how we see opportunities for strengthening cooperation between Namibia and Edo State. Uh, our relations between our two countries, Namibia and Nigeria, are very good as Nigeria has supported the people of Namibia during our struggle for independence. Uh, as many of you might remember, many Namibian students were hosted here in federal colleges, and many Nami Nigerians are, uh, fondly remember our founding father of the Namibian nation, Dr. Sam Nioma, who frequently came to Namibia, uh, Nigeria during the days of the struggle. So today, 
Namibia and Nigeria maintain cordial relations and we have quite strong cooperation in various areas. Uh, we are hoping this year or next year we will host the fifth session of the Namibia-Nigeria Joint Commission of Cooperation that discuss cooperation in various areas. Our visit today um, is aimed at strengthening relations with Edo State and sharing a few ideas where the opportunities are. Uh, we feel that Edo State, as the heartbeat of the nation of Nigeria, uh, has quite a lot of opportunities where Namibian business people could tap in. And to that end, we are hoping we can come and participate in the Benin Expo, the trade expo that will take place either later this year or early next year. That will give us an opportunity to showcase Namibian products, but also firsthand observe what products are produced in uh, Edo State. So we are very encouraged from our meeting with His Excellency the Governor uh, that there are many opportunities uh, for cooperation, for bilateral trade, uh, and, and many other areas. Uh, for example, the Governor has uh, expressed interest to work with Namibia in the area of uh, animal husbandry uh, because Namibia has considerable expertise uh, producing quality beef and exporting that uh, quality beef to the rest of the world. So we are very encouraged with meeting the governor of Edo State. Uh, we express our best wishes for continued progress in various endeavors and we continue to be encouraged by the progress that is registered here uh, in this state. According to Wikipedia, only 2% of Namibia land receives sufficient rainfall to grow crops. Agriculture for Namibia contributes around 5% of the national gross domestic product GDP. True say, 24% to 40% of Namibia depend on substantial agriculture and heading. Their primary products include livestock and meat products, crop farming and forestry. Make una not forget say, as we see them, now so we they talk them, we know they take blame. From Government House, Benin City. So if you they right, we na still live on a comment below. If you they bad, we na still live on a comment below. We na remember say, everybody gets freedom of speech. Okay? All right. Thank you very much. To So if you they watch me, you never subscribe, my brother, sister. I beg you in the name of God. Make you hit that red button and turn on the notification bell. So each time I upload any video, you will get you will get notification and you will constantly watch me. Thank you very much. See you again in my other video. I love you all. Bye bye.